Number 8. Let's start with this memorial scent recently sold on eBay. 1991s Proof Lincoln Scent. Graded as PF70 Ultra Cameo by NGC. This high-end gem is unsurpassable in terms of strike, preservation and eye appeal. A condition rarity for a modern scent featuring frosty device elements and liquid-like fields. Number 7. This is 1909 SVDB Lincoln scent in MS65 condition. Satiny red and brown example. According to Heritage Auctions, a pleasing gem red and brown example of this key date, showing blended amber, chestnut, and copper gold hues across satiny luster and well-defined devices. No major abrasions are evident, nor carbon spots. I appeal is excellent for the grade. Gem examples of the 1909 SVDB scent are always in demand, across all three color classifications. This one ended up selling for $3,720 on September 15, 2023. Number 6. Here is 1970s Lincoln scent in MS65 red condition. Elusive double dye obverse variety. A pleasing gem red example of this important guidebook variety. Dye doubling is strong on In God We Trust, and is faintly visible on the date. Each side of the coin shows satiny copper gold luster with a reddish tinge. There are no carbon spots, which strengthens the eye appeal. It was sold for $4,080. Number 5. This is 1913 Lincoln scent in PR67 red and brown condition. A sharp, pristine 1913 matte proof, showing broad, squared rims and a rich amber red hue across each side. The tone is a deep red not truly brown, nor truly red, and thus appropriately designated red and brown even though it is a single color overall. No carbon spots are seen. The 1913 proof is rare in this lofty grade. It was sold for $5,040. Number 4. This is 1955 Lincoln scent with double dye obverse. Graded in mint state 64 brown by PCGS. Luminous chestnut brown luster yields hints of steel blue and lilac color when rotated beneath the light. The strike is sharp, and I appeal is excellent for the grade. This is a true mint state brown coin, with no evidence of wear. The 1955 double dye is a major guide book variety and is sought after in all grades. It fetched a sum of $5,520. Number 3. This is 1916 Matte Proof Lincoln Scent in PR65 Red Condition. The 1916 Matte Proof Lincoln Scent comes from a small mintage of 1,050 coins, the bottom rung of a mintage decline that began after 1910, when Matte Proof Scent production hit its peak of 4,083 pieces. The 1916 is the rarest Matte Proof in high grade after the 1909 VDB. This gem red 1916 is tack sharp and offers a rich array of cherry red, copper orange, and golden green colors. A few scattered specks are seen on the reverse as usual for a coin that has not been dipped. This rare gem ended up selling for $9,987.50. Number 2. Here is popular mint era variety. 1944 Lincoln cent struck on a zinc-coated steel planchet. This coin was tooled and cleaned therefore NGC assigned AU details. The 1944 steel scent is valuable and rare because it is a one-year error coin issued by the United States Mint during World War II. Due to the scarcity of copper during the war effort, the Mint used steel to make pennies in 1943. However, a few 1944 pennies were mistakenly struck in steel planchets meant for the 1943 pennies, making them highly sought after by collectors. Only a few are known to exist, making them valuable. This one fetched a sum of $19,975 on eBay. Number 1. And this is attractively toned 1909 VDB Lincoln scent in red and brown condition. This 1909 VDB Lincoln scent certified PR67 plus red and brown PCGS, with the added CAC gold label, is a legendary coin among aficionados of matte proof Lincolns. Adding further to its credentials, the present coin traces its pedigree to the monumental collection of celebrated Philadelphia merchant and numismatist John Story Jenks, 1839-1923. Generous daubs of rose pink dominate the upper hair and forehead of Lincoln and a bit of the reverse around the tea and scent, seeding to light sandy orange colors accented with glints of jade throughout the fields and the remainder of the devices on each side. The fine matte texture is completely pristine and unperturbed throughout, complementing the full proof strike and squared off inside rims. There is absolutely no trace of carbon, contact, 
or any other distraction. It was sold for $258,500. Thanks for watching this video. Consider subscribing to our channel for more captivating numismatic content. Have a good one.